hello guys welcome back to the channel today we are going to create a new character using ready player me by metaverse so to create a new character uh, click on the avatar create avatar by the way I'll give the this link in the description down below so in this area we can choose whether you want to go to half body or full body right now I'm going to create a new full body so from there we can choose the gender of the character I'm going to use masculine a boy you can do without uh, adding pictures so continue with the photo and you can from this you can choose a avatar any avatar that you like uh, right now I'm going to use this one now we can customize the character in this area uh, so first of all we can create a new character like I'm going to give a light shade and let's give him a brand new cloth hmm. and likewise let's give him a new hairstyle but that's better and now you can choose hair color from it so give a little darker and you can give also give a beard I'll give this one oh. Oh, this look good so <coughs> you can do any other things now after uh, customizing your create character in this area you can after that you can go to enter hub so that it will prepare your Alvater. Yeah, now we have created a uh, Alvater. So now we can download this Alvater to use in other platform like uh, Blender, Unity, Unreal Engine. So to do that, you need to click on three dot and then click on download Alvater. GOP format. now I have uh, download the character so let's try to import in blender now I'm going to import a blender by using because it's use <coughs> uh, GLB format so we can click on the GLTF 2.0 and now we're going to select the character that we have downloaded now we have successfully imported and one thing is you don't have to rig the character it's already pre-rigged so let's open the textures visible display mode in front to see the our bones character now click on this and control tab to go in edit mode in blender so now we can see whether it is uh, good to go or not so yeah it's pre-rigged and it's pretty good so and you can use this character for other 3d platforms like game engines unity and unreal engine and other animation software and that is for today's tutorial video and thank you for watching bye bye see you next time